Hello there, this is Lynn Allen. Welcome to another AutoCAD tip courtesy of Catalyst Magazine. I hope wherever you are in the world that the weather is nice. Uh, I'm in Portland, Oregon and it's over 100 degrees, so it is hot. And I'm going to share with you some hot tips today. See how I did that? <laughs> they have to do with M text. So in AutoCAD 2015, Autodesk added some a whole bunch of cool features into mText, and I want to make sure you know about them. All right, so the first one, um, I'm just going to go ahead and double click on this mText, and I want you to notice that the mText editor is transparent. So if you, you have AutoCAD 2015 or higher, you can actually see through to the objects that are underneath the text. So you can see if you're running over them or not, right? That's a nice feature. I don't really want to do anything with it zoomed out that far. I'm going to zoom in a little bit closer. We all know that if we're, well, depending on how your settings are, if you are zoomed out really far from your text, you double click on it, it's going to blow it up for you, right? Okay, so that's what just happened. But I'm going to zoom up now. I'm going to double click again so I can go into the M text editor. And if you've ever tried to work with columns inside of M text, you know it can be very frustrating. So with AutoCAD 2015 though, I'm so glad they fixed this. So much easier, right? Just grab the slider bars, whether it's on the corner or the sides. So much easier to work with, am I right? Uh, that'll save a lot of headaches for sure. All right, so we also have the ability to easily change the size of the columns inside of mText. All right, one more. Have you ever accidentally had your cap lock on when you started typing inside of mText. Okay, I just turned my cap lock on. You cannot see, you're just going to have to believe me. And then I'm gonna type in the word like hello or something like that. Clearly I can see on the screen that that's not what I want, but I would notice that right away. I'm gonna go ahead and hit the space bar and AutoCAD's like, hey, I happen to know that that was not what you wanted. There's no way you wanted to start a sentence with a lowercase letter and have the rest uppercase. You must have accidentally had your cap lock on. I am here to fix that for you. <laughs> That's exactly what mText does. It will fix, correct the word so that it's uppercase in the very first character and the rest are lowercase, and then it will turn the cap lock off for you. Oh yeah, that is service, am I right? That is some pretty good service. So those are a few of the new features that came out inside of AutoCAD 2015, which you can enjoy if you have 15, 16, or 17. When I come back in a couple more weeks, I'm gonna show you some other very cool features about mText, okay? So uh, stay cool wherever you are, and I will see you back here in two more weeks.